Hi friends, welcome again. So we are studying climate patterns. In the previous video we covered El Nino and in this video we are going to cover what is La Nina. La Nina means little girl in Spanish. As we have seen in the previous video that during the normal condition trade winds blow from east to west in the Pacific Ocean. It takes warm water from South America towards Asia and to replace that warm water cold water rises from the depth of the ocean. This process is called upwelling. La Nina has the opposite effect of El Nino. During La Nina, trade winds blow from east to west but are stronger than usual, pushing more warm water towards Asia. Off the west coast of America, upwelling increases, bringing cold, nutrient-rich water to the surface. Now, let's see what are the impacts of La Nina. During a La Nina year, winter temperatures are warmer than normal in the south and cooler than normal in the north. La Nina can also lead to a more severe hurricane season. La Nina causes drought in the South American countries of Peru and Ecuador. It usually has a positive impact on the fishing industry of Western South America. This is because during La Nina, waters off the Pacific coast are colder and contain more nutrients than usual. This environment supports more marine life and attracts more cold water species to places like the California coast. It also leads to heavy floods in Australia.